<laughs> yes, we have either a half pirouette or a full, which either it's 180, 360 degrees, and it executed on two tracks. So, uh, the radius is equal to the length of the horse. Well, it's difficult to have another radius, I suppose. <laughs> then the pirouettes or half pirouettes are usually carried out at the collected walk, we saw that yesterday, uh, canter, and also it is possible to do it in PF in the freestyle. In the pirouette or half pirouette, the forefeet and the outside hand foot move around the inside foot. The, hind, the inside hind leg describes a circle or half circle as small as possible. Then we go we continue. In the pirouette, the horse is slightly bent in the direction in which it's turning, remaining on the bit with a light contact and turning smoothly. And this around and maintaining the exact sequence of footfalls of that pace. The pole stays the highest point during the entire movement. During the pirouettes or half pirouettes, the horse should maintain his impulsion and never in the slightest way move backwards or deviate sideways. In executing the pirouette or the half pirouette in canter, the rider should maintain perfect lightness of the horse while accentuating the collection. The hindquarters are well engaged and lowered and show a good flexion of the joints. An integral part of the movement is the quality of the canter strides before and after the period. There should be an increased activity and collection before the period. The balance should be maintained when the horse exits the period. One should be able to recognize a real canter stride, all the feet, although the feet of the diagonal inside or front might not touch the ground simultaneously. <coughs> so, and then you have to draw it. I think when we start, the first half of the period was very good. And then the horse gets tense and gets a little bit straight and, turn, uh, and starts turning by himself. Then you take the horse again. For me, it's very important when we talked about yesterday, the section and bending into bending in the period. Only then I'm able to stop that when the horse is going to uh, spin around with the outside right rein. Because only with the outside right rein I can fix it, not only with my leg, with sitting inside, but altogether most important is this outside right uh, outside rein, which stops that when the horse tries to move too quick around. Ashley, uh, Anna Marie, let's say they do once again, go diagonally, <coughs> and then make really sure that you have the flexion and banking, and the, yeah, that you have a loose inside, that the inside high leg can jump forward because the, 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 the rein is uh, also loose on the inside rein. So, make it round in his leg and then start now. So, turn, sit forward, stop outside leg, outside leg, yeah, boy, go exactly, go forward, go, 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 go on, go on, bend him, go stay here, stay here in the period. Bend him, so bend him, exactly, now turn in front, exactly, go from bend him, bend him, inside leg, inside leg, inside leg, bend him to the left, make him loose inside, yeah, boy, make him loose inside, bend him, yeah, boy, bend him, exactly, exactly, you see how it takes weight now, no? Bend him, yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Perfect. And out. Flying change of leg and right. We saw that. How much better the horse became when she had this bad knee and she put the stopping with the outside brain and then the horse only with the right brain and it's really collecting the knee. When you get deep again, the same to the right. Make it loose inside. So I now start. And don't let him turn around. Bad hip, exactly. You feel that? And once. Turn in front. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. And out. And out. It can happen. Out. You saw that, all of them, that was a lot, lot better, a lot better taking weight behind than before. And because she has this lecture bending, the horse can spin around. We once again here, and then we go to zigzag. One period again. Left him. Comes inside leg. Bend him. And now stop turning yourself. Bend him. Make him loose inside. Exactly. 100% better. 100% better. Exactly. Go forward, yeah, boy, and out. Prima. That was a lot better. Good. We do the whole period. Oh, we can do them now. Maybe that makes more sense. 
And when you do it now like the one circle, I do it like in the intermediate one. We have half diagonal period, half diagonal period, whole one. Yeah? Let's try it. And now it's very important. As small as the period is, as more the horse try to jump around because he has really taken weight and it's really hard stuff. And make sure that he didn't spin around. Turn, young boy, turn, aim up. Not faster, not faster. Good, okay. Like change and then the same to the left. Inside leg, bend it inside. Oh, and now turn it front. Turn it front and turn. Yeah, boy. Can't talk, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Good, good turn. Yeah. The left one we do once again. The right one was still a little bit too big, but from the rhythm everything was fine. But the left one we do once again, uh, Ana Maria. Do you feel that when you stop, when you change behind, that you correct? Yeah? Only the left. Do it from there and come half diagonal. And you don't have to make it faster, only try to make it really active, but not fast at the period. So, and then tap him maybe with the whip if you feel you want to stop. And then now turn in front. And turn. Yeah, but not faster. Right rein. Good. Right rein. Okay, right rein. Good. And out. We make a break. You saw that, that uh, this period, uh, it was not as good as it was in the working period before. In the working period, it was really taking weight like this. And in this last small period, he tried to go a little out with the hind legs and came really higher in the group than before. No? Mm -hmm. And for me, she has to do a little bit more of the working period before she do really the very small ones at home to train it. Because he, he changed the way of the period at once when you did the working period and did it in the right way. So I think he's easily able to do that. But I think a few more working periods and then slower get smaller. Huh? Not like this, working period and then a very small one. The moment that is too early, for me it was too early, I could do very carefully, step by step, the period to live small. 